I can't tell. Uh, I don't think we're on yet. When this loads, I'm gonna do my intro. So if I am on, hello, welcome. But, uh, yeah, I'm just waiting. Welcome to fuck three. <laughs> It's me, Logan, and welcome to The Walking Dead, Saints and Sinners. Woo wee, I can't wait to be scared of shit when one of them breaks down my fucking door. Let's continue. It's all fucking dusty. <laughs> Worn down guns will sometimes jam. Recock it to clear the chamber and continue firing. Well, that's kind of bullshit. Is that like a fucking... Like, a sawed-off pump shotgun? How does that even make sense? Is that like a, uh, one of those small shotguns? Probably is, and I'm just being stupid. A shotgun revolver! Alright, the walking dead saints and sinners. Worn down guns will sometimes jam and cock it to clear the chamber. Continue firing. Well, I don't have any <sighs> guns. So get nerd. Dude, I really like this game. It makes you feel so fucking powerful. Alright, yeah, so last time, uh, I kinda just left it, uh, on my own, because my internet shut down for a while. And I made a bow, multiple, but I still need to upgrade to make, uh, arrow bundles for when you need to make more than one point. So yeah, what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to get wood scraps, so I need to go out there and get, like, about a bunch of wood scraps. There's people out there, so now I need a fucking revolver. So I crafted a revolver, and I have a knife, and I have a bow. So I think I'm gonna be fine for right now. I also have a shiv. So I'm gonna go out there. Do I need more bandages? Yeah, I think I need more bandages before I go out. I'm gonna get more. Yeah, overnight I got really good at the game. Uh, not exactly good, but I did take out some people. Alright. There we go. Alright, let's continue. Ah! Alright. So, if you guys don't know what this game is, it's basically like a... I think it's like the VR edition of the... Remember that Walking Dead game? Like the Telltale one? But now it's just in VR and it's not that much of a story. But yeah, come on, uh, I also unlocked different areas, but I'm not... I'm not trying to go there yet, because uh, I want to finish off every single area before, go to, before I go to different areas. Pay attention to humans' verbal warnings and the aggravation icons over their heads. So, yeah, it's kind of like a sneaky game when you're trying to, like, sneak into places. But with the, uh, with the place that I'm about to break into, uh, 
it's literally impossible to hide from the first person. So I'm just gonna fucking stab him and move on. That's why I need multiple bandages, because he's gonna fucking shoot me for sure. Alright, this timer right here, like when it when it red goes all the way to that red part, I think that's when the bell rings. And I'm not staying around to figure out if that's what happens. But that's that's my theory. So with my map, I think I'm gonna go over to this house. I already went through this house and I killed both of them. Are they still over here? Might be some new people. Who's sneaking around? Who's snaking around? I don't even like the way you walk. The way you you must be so <laughs> Bitch. See, it's that simple. And, uh... I guess they respawn every time. But I'm gonna go through that house over there in a second. I think I just need to get this. I'm gonna drop it in there. And just shoot it. Over here. Oh shit, I died for that. No. That's dummy. It's a big old dummy. Okay, collect your loot location when you die. If you die, you can do work with more loot and you'll last forever. That's fine. Alright. I think I'm timed. Still have my bow. If I do. Alright, let's collect some wood. I don't think I'm ready to go attack them yet. So I'm gonna collect wood. And then I'm gonna go attack them. That is my plan. <laughs> so yeah, those are used to distract the zombies. But, uh, I'm a dumbass and I never use them. So let's go inside of here. Be some goodies in here. Alright. Zombies are gonna respawn over here, so. I'm just gonna close this up. Keep it like that. Alright. Sorry if it's not that good with the uh, lighting. I can't see shit either. Todd cigarettes! I could go for smoke right now. Shit. <laughs> I like how I fucking, instead of bringing out my flashlight, I bring out my fucking. Uh, whatever it's called. Alright, you know what? I'm gonna use some of these bottles to distract them. Actually, I have no idea. Why does this door look like the one from Luigi's Mansion? Of cigarettes because they also have wood scraps. Now, every zombie inside of the house is gonna know where I am. That's cool. <sighs> no, I 
definitely can't grab that. I'm gonna have way too much cigarettes after this. Bon party. Wrong thing. I don't need that. Watch. Am I already really cool? Shit, I am. I need this one anyways. Guys, I got money. Money, money, money. Okay. I'm gonna use this to throw it at. Okay, I was about to get really weirded out from that. Alright, All right, there they go. Hurry up along, bitches. I said, hurry the fuck up along. Fuck, I missed. You know what? I gotta go down there anyways. Let's take care of them. Okay. I don't need that. How do I get back downstairs? Okay. I will fuck you up. <laughs> Okay, I dropped my phone accident. <sighs> okay, did I miss anything? Do I need anything? Okay, my arrow. Right there. <sighs> you better fuck off wherever you are. Sing around, figure out who the fuck that is. Back up. It's okay. Die! What the fuck? Please, like, just fuck off. Okay. How many scraps do I have? I'm gonna go back and see if I have enough. I'm not gonna waste my shit on them. I'm out. To the racing place. Dude, honestly, I'm not sure how, like, in the show, like, when zombies are behind them, I'm not sure how people don't fucking notice that they're behind them. Because, like, you can hear it so... They're so fucking loud. Like, it's... It's just kind of stupid. Remember to use your flashlight in dark areas. Shake to charge. I already know how to do all that. You do not know how many people I fucking killed in this game. It's kind of bad. I think I killed like 14 already. But they, they do drop really good stuff. Like shotgun. Whatever. The only reason why I no don't bring my shotgun. Is because uh, I don't have any ammo for it right now. So, if I went to the base and I brought out my shotgun, they would probably kill me immediately. Because if you even draw your gun, they're like, hey, get the fuck out. Like, they don't want you in there at all. Remember to use your phone. Right. Time to run back. 
Yeah, I really don't want to stay around when the bell rings, because, uh, that would not be good. Okay, I'm gonna go recycle my shit, and I'm gonna go to bed, and then I'm gonna start a new day. Scraps. Scraps. I'm gonna keep that. I want to get one of the FS-19 millimeter. There we go. Okay, let me see how much I have now. Wood scraps. There, it don't, it doesn't tell me. There we go. Maybe I'm just being stupid, but I don't think it tells me. It's not ready, how much do I have? Okay, I need like way fucking more. Ooh, dude, that would be actually so nice to have a fucking rifle. Wait, is that a rifle or a shotgun? It's a double barrel. Is there a pump? Right, that's a pump shotgun. Alright, you know what? Doesn't take anything. Wait, does this have anything? Adhesives, alright. Um, does this need adhesives? No, it doesn't, so I don't need this. And workable metal. Okay. Oh! Maybe I should bring another shiv with me, because I know mine's gonna break soon. It's already halfway. I'm gonna need a crowbar right now. Yeah, these two weapons suck. Like, it takes like two hours just to like pull it out of their head. I guess I can bring a spoon. Just in case. I don't need another bow and arrow. Does it have any ammo in it right now? Nope, there's nothing in it. Okay, well, I need to work up to make some ammo for it. It's the max level over, I think. What do I need for that? Workable metal, nuts and bolts, and wood. Alright, workable metal, nuts and bolts, and wood. That's all I need. And then after that, I'm gonna go kill all those son of a bitches at the house. Because there's a lot of them, and only one of me, so. That's why I'm trying to kind of keep safe. It's not safe. Oh, it's nighttime. Fuck, yeah, I need to go to bed. I'm surprised no zombies walk around here anymore. It's kind of weird. Is my friend still here? Nope, he's just not talking to me. Son of a bitch. Yeah, I don't know if I should bring this crowbar because it. Look, I'm gonna just very go down like very smoothly. Look how much it shakes. I know if I hold it with one hand it works, but you can only go like that. Not like that. So that's why this crowbar kind of sucks. But I could bring it just in case. That's my plan. Also, there's these things. Like, uh, toy animals. And I found one back there. And I'm not sure if it's like for a mission or something. I really like this game. I know I've said that like a million times. This game is like super fun. Build supplies of Dundle, but then have grown in number. Nothing has changed. <sighs> <sighs> Good morning. Yeah, I just need wood. I'm gonna go back out there. Or no, I need wood, workable net, metal, nuts and bolts. All right. So I'm just gonna go out there with like, you know, the wood pieces, and I'm gonna get workable metal, and then nuts and bolts. That's actually pretty simple. I'm gonna go on a wood run first, cause, uh, wood is like the most, you know, vehicle. 
Yeah, so the whole town is, like, flooding for some reason, and nothing's, like, they can't, like, on-flood it, so <laughs> when floods happen, I guess they're just there forever. Alright, so in the first part, I had to shoot to, like, a bunch of them in the water. I didn't even know zombies could swim until the fourth season of The Walking Dead, uh... The Telltale one, not the show. Workable metal, nuts and bolts. Perfect. This is actually pretty good. Not the best, but... Alright, where are y'all? Georgia? Who the fuck is Georgia? Did you guys hear that? I heard something. Hello. I'm not gonna shoot you guys Shit. this time. I don't even so like the way you walk. Do you really want to fuck with me? I it's suggest near. you get lost. You find some way to me. Oh. Ah. Fuck. Ah. Fuck her. Fuck. Well, you know how to fuck with me. <sighs> fuck, there's still one of you? Fucker. Stay dead. Oh my god. Let's look for some wood again. There's nothing. There's no one in here, anyways. So. Do you have any wood in it? I do have adhesives. I need that. I need wood. Take one for the road, just in case. Yeah, so there's like toys like this. I don't know what they're for, but they're special. Is it really already full? It can't be. I don't need this. I don't need this either. Oh, I didn't even salvage most of my shit. Alright, I'm gonna show you what we're going for right now. I'm gonna go over there, and I'm gonna show you what's going on. Because they're friendly unless I pull out my guns. But they're an absolute asshole, anyways. Hey, what's up, man? This is fun. You're inside of me. Mr. Taurus. Now I'm gonna show you what we're going for. Or what we're up to. Hey! <laughs> 
Okay, I have to get the stab right. Drops some fucking cigarettes. Cause these are better. I need to go to the front of the house, not the fucking back. I'm not gonna be able to run through that. So there's these motherfuckers over here, and there's all these guys, and there's people around here. There's three of them. There's three over here. There's one guy over here. Hey, speedy. And then there's a girl up there, or a guy. Hey, and then you fucking beat it. I got for more. Quit poking around. Why oh, don't you quit poking around? I smell something rotten. Get the hell out of here! Jeez. So yeah, there's also that Ain't area. They just keep coming. We won't have a problem. Yeah, so I'm definitely. I almost took him out once, Let's but I didn't have enough bullets or enough knives. I think I'm ready to go back. I have a better way to deal with this. No, not that. Stop killing the zombies. No, you didn't notice me. All right, I made it out. This game is fucking intense, dude, I swear. You know, it's PSVR, so it's probably not going to have the best graphics right now. Has anyone commented? Two comments. Zombie. Damn, we got a trilogy going here. Nine minutes ago, how can 2007? Zombie. And that makes perfect sense. You should probably be the next Albert Einstein, man. Like, not going to lie.
So yeah, it do I don't think it actually has like a real loading system. I think it just like plays a video that has a loading system and it's not accurate at all. Like a GIF that has a loading system or some bullshit. Seven out of forty. Well, I gotta go a lot of wood. I need to see how much wood it produces, though. So I think I still need nuts and bolts. Well, no, everything has nuts and bolts. Dude, I got a lot of nuts. Oh shit, man! This is one that I need to save. Because it's a special in it. I like how the pillow is heavy for the character. Like, the weight system in this game is kind of broken. And it's really funny. Orange blades. Too. I don't want any weapons right now. So zero rounds. Oh, I'm gonna take it. I might need it later. It's gonna be like some zombie infestation at my base. You never know. See? Now I have bundles of arrows. Now we can do some action. I need for this. Work for metal. Okay. Well, right now. Wait, so it's purple metal and nuts and bolts. Does this take nuts and bolts? No, it doesn't. So I'm just gonna keep building it. Do I have now for my arrow? Like a million? Let me see. 42! That seems amazing. Alright, how much do I have for my gun? Oh, this is the right one. I have zero in it. Oh, 12 rounds though. Is this the right one that I was using? I think it was. Got everything. And my arrow. I think I might need this. Not absolutely necessary, but I might need it. I just need a saver. Workable metal. That's and nuts and bolts. Wait. So. War arrows seems really good. And also, survival of the fittest. Stamina is increased by 25%. Okay. Boyer. Increased your ability for arrows. That would also be really good. Lower arrows also, I think, are going to be probably the best thing. But for right now, we don't have it. And what do you take? What was I going to craft again? I forget. Uh, shit, I think I was going to craft. Need shafts. Okay, I think I am good for right now. I am gonna go to bed on the game, and then I'm gonna go the next night, and then I'm gonna fucking kill all those bastards. <sighs> Alright, you gotta leave the stream. This is when the action starts. <laughs> oh, I'm not.
not sure if I'm ready, but I'm gonna try. <sighs> I made myself some food. That's what I forgot. Damn it. Yeah. No, I need medicine. Fuck. Okay, well, I can't make medicine yet. Uh. I want to get this soon. That's my plan. Maybe in the early, uh, later areas. Because, uh. I think when you shoot those survivalists over there, you know, those ones that are always like, hey, fuck off, like the two of them, I think when you uh, shoot them, sometimes they drop like an actual gun instead of a broken gun. And I'm trying to get that pump shotgun from that one guy. But I think I might just wait to craft it. Because I haven't gotten a real gun from them yet. So I guess it's time. I'm gonna collect some bottles and then I'm gonna go up there and I'm gonna fucking beat the shit out of them. Guns are loud, using them draws attention. Well, and why- Yeah, so one time, I only used a gun to go in there, and that's how I died. Because, uh... Well, they didn't even hear me, that's the thing. But I ran out of bullets, so they killed me. And I didn't- and my, uh... My stabby stabby was broken. So, I'm not sure if it draws attention. Maybe it'll zombies. But I haven't seen it with humans. <laughs> They're like, wait, what was that? After, like, their friend gets fucking shot in the head. Dude, the AI in this game is fucking hilarious. Sometimes they survive headshots, and that's, like, the weird thing. Kind of doesn't make sense. Walker just walked through that and was gonna be like, what the fuck? No, I was all like, ass. And he was all like, <laughs> epic, bro. Hey, do you want a shoe? Go get it. <laughs> no other people see me. That's good. I'm not wasting any of my arrows. I'm just taking them out with the fucking screwdriver. Kill these motherfuckers. Hey, what was that? Like, don't give a shit after like two minutes.
Yeah, someone is fucking close. Hey, strong enough word for you. Yeah, come over your fuck face. Scan in the area. Start. I have a new plan. Dude, this is this one is impossible, I swear. Alright, I'm not gonna waste my my bandages until I really need them. I think I need to find medicine or something else inside of there before I get in there. Cause that was a disaster. This time, I'm going straight there, and they don't fucking see me. It's gonna suck. Pretty aim my gripping guns with both hands. Yeah, I was trying to do that, but it's... It's very difficult when they're shooting at you. You get what I'm saying? Alright, no, new plan. Let's try it the other way, because I'm... I shoot with my right. Honestly, I don't give a shit on what happens to my arrows. So let's just see. Diseased walkers. That's bullshit. I don't need this. Keep it for right now. That's good. I'm gonna use. I need to get at least one bottle. I want to take out the first guy pretty quickly. Hey, what's up, guy? Hey, what's up, guys? It's me. Ding dong. Alright. Welcome back to another prank video, guys. Fucking screwdriver.
I need to find medicine for this guy. Sneaking around, I don't know. Also, why does everyone in the fucking Walking Dead have a fucking country accent, even though you come from, uh, what is it called? I don't remember. I'm just a country boy surviving zombies. Man, it's all. <coughs> Fuck, I need to stop. Should I just like fucking. I'm gonna leave this out here for me. <sighs> I need to figure out a way to fucking just. I know there's a way to do it. I'm just gonna. Okay, you know what? Fuck it. Can I throw it? Okay. I'm going in. That's why I need that fucking hatchet. I'm gonna go back. Okay. I'm really low, and I need something to keep me alive. Why does everything have to be fucking hard in this game? Because it's a fucking game, Logan. Okay. No, I'm gonna try it. What tarnation was that? Who's sneaking around? Who are you sneaking around? I don't know, man. Dude, are you serious? I was so fucking close. I was so fucking close. I was so fucking close. Are you 
restart level. Shit. Or right, you know, I'm going fucking sneaky mode, dude. Now I know where those guys are. I need to be very careful about that. Omens block most gunfire and burning attempts. Look for patches of explode fit. Explo exposed flesh. Why don't I just take their helmets? <laughs> this is actually surprisingly really difficult. Alright. I'm just going in right now. Can I read this one? Oh, I thought I could climb up there. I was about to say, this would have been the easiest job ever. Even though I can climb up everything. Alright, I'm gonna try this way. Fuck, never mind. Now is not the time to be selfish. Now is the time to commit to a community. To be part of something. Our vision for the future is rooted in hope. It ensures a future for humanity. Cast despair aside. There is no point in clinging to it. Do not commit to isolation. Dedicate yourself to a grander purpose. And you will not be alone. Trust in us to guide you. And we will put our trust in you. Within our walls, you will be safe. Within our walls, your needs will be met. Within our walls, life goes on. The tower. Yes, these are also things I need. I don't know why I need them, but I'm pretty sure they have something to do with something. I get an AR eventually? Jesus. Shit. Someone's close. Might throw something past there. Keep it. I'm using my arrows, you know what? <sighs> restart, restart. <sighs> Dying a lot, try upgrading the crafting tables, get better weapons, consumables, and stats. Alright, you know what? I'm just gonna fucking bow all of them. They're all gonna get fucking bowed. I'm gonna stab that first guy. I'm gonna bow the rest of- I'm gonna bow the one that's watching over. And then I'm gonna go inside. Uh, and then I'm gonna fucking 
just explode them. That's my plan. I need to get kind of far away from it, though, or else I'm gonna die. I have a perfect plan. Okay. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. <sighs> okay. I got this. I'm just fucking skipping past walkers. I don't wanna deal with that shit. Now is not the time to be selfish. Now is the time to commit to a community, to be part of something. Our vision for the future is rooted in hope. It ensures a future for humanity. Cast despair aside. There is no point in clinging to it. Do not come to isolation. Dedicate to a grander purpose. And you will not be alone. Trust in us to guide you. And we will put our trust in you. Within our walls, you will be safe. Within our walls, your needs will be met. Within our walls, life goes on. The tower will always stand. Mama. Sneaking around. Fucking worry, show looking ass. How are you? Take this ass are you this down. dumb? All right. Honestly, man, it was kind of your fault. Fuck, I don't have a hatch at this time. around this time. Who's there? I shouldn't have wasted that bottle.
What? Oh yeah, I am full. I am doing this. I am now going to attempt to try this. Alright. Now. What was that? You being a dumbass. Okay. I don't have to open the door yet. Is there no gasoline tank now? Please tell me there's a fucking tank. anything? No, I did not. Thinking I might steal one of those solid gold lion statues. Class up my hobble. Crawl back in his hole. Ah. Bitch. I don't see anything. You don't see anything, really. Oh. Fuck. Oh. Oh. Bitch. My bow and arrow? No, I do not. So it is right here. I need to heal badly. <sighs> oh, okay. Guys, we did it. Let's please hope that nobody is around here. He's not there anymore. Okay. Just making sure so my plan doesn't go wrong. Through the slogan, you got this. There we go. Oh, oh my God.
know what I'm looking for. I heard mama sick. Dude, this game is super fucking dark. Like, not like in theme, like, it's just fucking dark as shit in this game. I don't know what that's like, that's kinda weird. I'm trying to find medicine. I'm probably gonna have to abandon it. Let's take this asshole down! Keep coming! Walter! 
was literally about to get out too. Oh my fucking god, no. Okay. Continue. I'm gonna go back for my shit. I'm gonna fucking kill those motherfuckers. Back with more fucking forces. I hope they don't fucking respawn. That would suck. So, I think I got what I needed to get, is that correct? Power, all right, use the drawing to find the tower cache, deposit the intel in the coffin. Okay, so now I just need to get the fuck out of here. Give me way more sense, and that's probably what I'm gonna end up fucking doing. Cause these people are psychopaths. What's up, man? they had different accents besides American and fucking I'm a country girl and I survived The Walking Dead and you're really glitching out the game so I'm just gonna not fucking do it. If you really want to get killed, we'll do it, man. Cause you seem to really not care right now. I'm just gonna grab your head and just gonna have a good old time. Have a good old time. Shit, buddy! Shit! Ow. Oh god. I can't feel my legs. Just gotta do some workouts. I have no idea what I tracked. I think I got enough stuff that I tracked here today. No, I still need gunpowder. Back to the resting place. We need to retrieve it and we need to put it into the coffin. For some reason. I don't fucking know why. I just imagine like someone goes through a whole gameplay while only holding the axe with one fucking hand. They, that's probably why everybody thought this game was shit because like they... <laughs> They're only holding it with like one hand. This game takes a lot of fucking work. Oh my god. The Walking Dead. Saints and Saters. Oh wait. Marshy said, scary. One hour ago. Best, best comments ever, guys. I 
large weapons are easier to control when held with both hands. Well, I already fucking said that. I don't know why I keep repeating it. I need to figure out a way to craft medicine. I need to craft medicine soon. All that. I have another bow. <sighs> okay. Workable metal. I think I'm gonna eat. I'm gonna get rid of it. It's not a big deal. May Benoit has the waterfall key. Find her. Get it. No reserve without it, understand? Mama's through fucking around with this. Snag Ombra if you have to. Can use the fucking brat as trade bait. This must happen. We have to expand this list otherwise. Georgia. Okay, well, I need to put that instead of the cove thing. If I knew that I only had to get that, I would have been out like, immediately. And everything I could salvage with wood. Exactly, need one more wood scrap to update it. Well, good family memories, I guess. In the fucking trash. <laughs> Alright, uh. What was that for? Yeah, that was for this. Any more fucking wood scraps? Dude, I'm literally just gonna, like. I bet you, I bet you, like, 100%, I'm just gonna strap one of these, cause, like, how much wood scraps does this have? Only three. Okay, wait, I know what let's grab this. Does nobody like this fucking way? Alright, now, I can make this. Negan bat. Are you kidding me? I need one more. Right, uh, these have wood scraps. No, they don't. What about my shotgun? No, it's not a big deal. I can make like a million bows, anyways. <sighs> Five. It's literally like fucking Breath of the Wild. Oh, your bow's broke? Okay, time to make a fun bat. <sighs> okay. I can't hold it from anywhere else besides this. I think I'm almost equipped to go out there. Just need a couple more things. Bring my shotgun with me just in case.
Hey. Well, kind of feel bad for the old man. But I just need to fend for myself for a minute because I don't want to deal with fucking walkers. Is it stored in here? That's what it said. Deposit the intel in the coffin. the time until the lantern is lit. No. Oh. Passing the time. So just... What do I need to do to pass some time? Because this makes no noise at all. It's like a fucking silent bat. That is going to happen, so I might as well fill it. I use so much ammo, dude. Bro, imagine having so much ammo. Here, let's see if he'll answer the call after I do this. Why aren't you answering the fucking call? Answer. Answer! Lantern still isn't lit. Yeah, I'm gonna go to sleep. So why do I have to, like, be in the creepiest place ever? <sighs> Hello? It's Casey. If you're there, please answer. I've got a situation. Please. I can hear you. What is it? Yeah, I, I got spooked the other day. The crash rattled me. I'm sorry. It's just... I don't know who to trust. There's not many decent options out there, but I'm getting desperate, so um, I, I need to take a chance uh, on you. W what do you think? Can, um, can you help me out? Sure. Please? You've got my attention. I've been hearing things from the tower radio chatter. They found something, and I need it. Bad. Problem is, I have no way to get my hands on it without help, w without you. Now, I'm willing to give up what I know about the reserve, in exchange. Does that sound fair? You don't have to lay it on so thick, Casey. Tell me what you need, then I'll tell you if I'm willing to help. A pump flow regulator. A tower patrol founded by Memorial Lane in the Garden District. Uh, it's just another useless piece of junk to them. The problem is, there's a potential showdown brewing over there between the patrol and a reclaimed camp. It could get bloody. Quickly. What else? I like to be fully informed before putting my ass on the line. Fair enough. What do you want to know? What's the area like? The Garden District was one of the wealthiest areas of the city, so, you know, no surprise, it avoided most of the flood damage. The folks hit hardest by the flood picked it as a spot for a memorial to victims. And two weeks later, when the dead started walking, 
The whole city was a damn memorial. Why are they fighting? Uh, you know, resources, territory, two opposed ways of thinking, butting heads. I mean, from everything I've been hearing on the radio the last couple of months, the bad blood just keeps getting worse. Look, I'm staying out of it, but I, I can feed you more details if you want. Who's running the show for each faction? Mama leads the tower. She founded the community. I don't know much else about her. She stays out of sight. Her right hand, her enforcer, is Georgia. Now, she's out there on the front lines daily. And from what I hear, she's a hard ass. Not afraid to mix it up. Get her hands dirty, you know? The reclaimed rally around this guy named JB. And no clue what it stands for. He's always proselytizing over the airwaves. Uh, frequency 54. Denouncing the tower. Saying they're already dead. I mean, it freaks me out a bit, but there's no denying he has charisma. How do they operate? What do they believe in? The tower is disciplined and committed to community. Everyone has to contribute to the cause. They must be doing something right. I've heard they have close to a thousand people inside their walls. Tower folks are fiercely loyal to their way of life. Maybe even to a fault. A bunch of loose cannons and the reclaimed. Hardly know what they're up to most of the time. Their tactics are all about surprise and intimidation. Guerrilla warfare mentality. And they love creeping the tower people out. Weird rituals and stuff. They seem less interested in control and more into sending a message. What's your take on all this? If the fighting keeps up, this city's gonna explode into an all-out war. The tower maintains some sort of order, right? I mean, they, they offer some sort of semblance of safety, sure, but... They don't hesitate to toss people out if they question authority. Once the tower kicks your ass out, there's no return. It seems cruel, but I don't know. Maybe that's the way it has to be. The reclaimed are eccentric. Let's put it that way. But JB really knows how to motivate, get people to buy into his vision. Maybe they're crazy, maybe they're onto something. I don't know, who knows? They are inspired, though. Always going on about the liberation to live, not just blindly following orders to barely survive. I mean, I, I don't know. Maybe they're both a bit fucked in the head. I've heard enough info on the conflict. Okay. Uh, sorry. I, I know I can ramble sometimes. I'm ready to do this. The pump regulator is a piece of industrial equipment, about the size of a coffee maker. Uh, pipes, switches, knobs, you'll know it when you see it. Now, the tower patrol has it at their camp, Red House on Memorial Lane. And remember, reclaimed are nearby, so you might get caught in the middle of a scrap between them. Now, once you have it in hand, hustle back to the radio and contact me. Time is not on my side. If you pull this off, I'll spill everything I know about the reserve. You have my word. the coffin and then we'll do the memorial lane thing. I hope that fucker was done with me, but not we can continue. I know Omri is dead, and I know that for the time being you stepped into his shoes, whoever you are. I am not in the habit of trusting people these days. Trust gets you dead when it's given to the wrong person. And there is a lot of wrong out there. But I am willing to set prejudice aside for a few moments so we can have a little chat. See if we can work together. I'm assuming you scored a few useful things out of that last tower cache. Well, there's more where that came from. As long as nothing happens to me. Understood? Get yourself to the churchyard. I will unlock the gate so you can reach the area. Stay out in the open. If I am satisfied you are alone, you will see me. Okay. That's interesting. This is what I'm gonna get for fucking uh, 
the 9mm or the FS 92mm. Okay. to Memorial Lane. Read the catacombs to meet with me in the churchyard. Okay. Let's go to the fucking catacombs then. That's what we're supposed to be doing. Okay. No, honestly, I think I could just go in there with like a fucking gun. the catacombs again. Okay, right there. Let's go down. That opened. I guess we can go through here. These skulls have gunpowder, so. Churchyard. Okay. Don't get used to meeting like this. It's a rarity. I understand. It's almost impossible to know who to trust. All right, then we're on the same page. I'll get to the point. Why are you helping me? Henri trusted you, so that's good enough for me. Were you two friends? I guess you could say we were new friends, sure. I saved his ass from a slew of walkers in the bayou. And I liked talking to the guy. He had a way about him. He sure did. My daughter was fond of him. Loved the way he could spin a tail. Well, may he rest in peace. You got some curmudgeonly shoes to fill. I'll point you to tower caches with useful supplies. And you get me the intel they contain. Sound like a deal? Deal. Maybe. But I have a question first. The tower seems to be after you and your daughter, Hardcore. What's that all about? You spotted those posters, huh? You wanna go there? All right, I'll give you the basics. I used to be with the tower. Now I'm not. We don't see eye to eye. I'm in the right, they are in the wrong. That's all I got for you now. Yeah, I'm on board. Good. Glad that's settled. Take this drawing. Intel at the location in the drawing. When you have it, leave it for me at the usual spot.
consider it done. I'm just gonna crouch away now. I wanna kinda explore this area. How good those graphics are under there. Is the church really blocked off? if I killed her. Man, it seems like everything's like blurred off. Going back. <sighs> Don't know why I need to fucking explain myself or everything, but I need to go back. Travel to the ward. Use a drone to find the tower cage and retrieve the intel. Kindness of strangers. Travel to Memorial Lane. Alright, so we have two options right now. Ward or Memorial Lane. I think the word sounds fun. Sounds spooky. Bring a bow and arrow. Maybe I should bring this. No, I'm gonna save it. I'm bring this guy.
scraps. What about this? Workable metal, nuts and bolts, and wood scraps. So I think multiple and wood scraps and multiple working metal is probably the thing that I need right now. I think I have some stuff actually for it. How much wood does this have? Not a lot. It's time to salvage some things, I guess. Jeez. We're going to that giant ass tower? Wait, really? Oh my god. Dude. Uh, I really hope we're not against those guys. That would suck. Trying to salvage some things, I guess. Let's see if I can upgrade some things. No, oh, that's not ready. Let's build some workable metal. Okay. Let's contonder. Or wait, I need. I'm such a dumbass. Need a fucking bow. Did I actually. Oh my god, am I that much of an idiot? Please tell me I am. Okay. No bow. Yes. Really shotgun then. No, I don't want you. <laughs> Sorry, I just want to be prepared. We don't have things to the world, so let's just go to the memorial lane, I guess. Oh, I have to craft to survive. Ooh wee, ooh wee. Well, I haven't, I haven't crafted a lot in this. very sustainable if I'm being honest.
Alright, let's go in here. No one gets inside. Strict orders. You have a problem with that? See Jeff. He's around the corner. Okay. This to happen. Walk away and we won't lower the weight. Well. She'll let me in. I think he's friendly. Oh god, he's glitching. Oh yeah, because I blew up his fucking head. Surprised to see Anthony missing his inside by nightfall. Get the hell out! Back it up. Did it break? Wait, how did it break? Oh, I blew it out. Shit. Can I get my fucking ammo back? Hello, I didn't What was he coming. thinking? These are you got nerve rolling in here uninvited. Don't mean to intrude. We don't need strays poking around right now. We have enough problems to deal with. Maybe I'm the solution. You know what? Yeah, you might prove useful. My brother is in some deep shit. Pack of reclaimed scum snatched him. Anthony's a good kid. Bit dim. But he doesn't deserve whatever those freaks have in store. We can't get anywhere near where they're holed up. Light blue house across the way. They'll gut him immediately if they see us coming. But you? They don't know you. You'll be able to stroll right in. After that, whatever you need to do, that's your business. Personally, I'd put a few bullets through their skulls. Let the dirt reclaim them. i like to know what I'm up against ahead of time. What are their numbers exactly? We've seen as many as four on the second floor. But you never know. They multiply like rats. Sounds like I can be of service. Get to it then. Knowing how those savages operate, mm -hmm. you might not have much time before they execute them. Kindness of Strangers task updated. Anthony, how could he be so dense? He should have known better. What was he thinking? These are people who have chosen to be stupid, not rational people, not people who understand and appreciate what the power is accomplished. Okay, so light blue house. Just don't realize what a scumbag they are. Yeah. 
So many broken guns around this place. Shit, wrong way. Oh. Let's try to knife it, I guess. Dude, I got a fucking cool hat. Who the hell are you? The negotiator? A big tough Jeff, too chicken shit to show his face and beg for his little brother's life? Not sure I really see the point. I guess I'm here to negotiate a deal for Anthony's release. Release? That's some kind of joke? That motherfucker isn't going anywhere but in the dirt, where maggots belong. What did he do? This subhuman shit is a murderer. My daughter is dead. The tower is at fault, and he is at fault. The tower preaches community, and yet they toss out those most in need because they are no longer useful, because they are a burden. Violet was not a burden. She was a human being, but this fucker treated her like trash. He could have disobeyed orders, 
But he did not. He forced her out, left her to die. She was 11 years old. Where is your head at, stranger? Exterminate this tower fuck right now, and we won't have a problem. Then we can pay the rest of the vermin a visit. And once they are a pile of corpses, whatever is in their camp, it's yours. Consider it a gift from the Reclaim. We did what we Fuck had to you. do, right? One less brain dead tower slug plaguing the world. Fuck it. I think it's time to put some pressure on these fuckers. We're outnumbered, but we have momentum, right? Yeah, the time is right fucking now. You with us? No time like the present. That's the attitude. We've got this. Let's send the message that the future belongs to the Reclaim. I really don't give a shit about like you these clans. I kind of want them both to die. Uh, at least I got a cool hat. Wait a minute. They fucking killed that one guy then. Shit, why am I teaming with them? Oh, it's both sides. Stop going to the This asshole must be You've got numbers. Jeez, these NPCs suck ass. I wonder if everyone died in the fucking zombie apocalypse. What should I do? You know what? I'm gonna fucking... Those blue guys are kinda assholes. They're both kinda assholes, if I'm gonna be honest. They fucking... Hang people for no reason. Like, what the fuck is that? Just kill them. Like, my god. Honestly, man, I'm gonna go back for another fucking shot. I don't think I'm ready yet, so... I need another shot, man. I think the tower is like the final area. 
Maybe, I don't know. Maybe you just gotta keep doing quests around the area and then you get out. I will never know. Guys, let's recycle my hand. If this game didn't have such long loading, it would be a pretty good game. Shit, like uh, like a cheat mode. You basically get like every single fucking gun in the game. Alright. Double shotgun, baby. <laughs> Honestly, man, I don't need that fucking melee. So I'm going to put... Shit. Back there. Right now... I'm gonna grab this crowbar. I'm gonna fucking salvage it. Uh, it's have a lot of good stuff. Durability. Doesn't have that much durability. This is probably a shitty weapon. Goodbye. Alright, can you craft anything else? Is anything ready? Nope. Might as well. I'm trying to get this. Sheet metal cleaver. Because it's really good in the survival mode. Alright. So, air station. I need a bunch of workable metal. Oh yeah, I heard night shift is also pretty good. have dwindled, the dead have grown in number. Find medicine. Alright, I guess I can travel everywhere now, apparently. Crouch movement makes less noise, sprinting makes more noise. Stay low and slow to avoid detection. Well, I kind of need to sit for a second. Minecraft be like, alright, uh, like literally nobody's gonna watch at this point, this is like the longest stream I've ever done.
suggest you get lost. I suggest you get lost. Quit poking around. You got a problem? You got nerve rolling in here uninvited. Don't mean to intrude. We don't need strays poking around right now. We have enough problems to deal with. Maybe I'm the solution. You know what? Yeah, you might prove useful. My brother is in some deep shit. Pack of reclaimed scum snatched him. Anthony's a good kid. Bit dim. But he doesn't deserve whatever those freaks have in store. We can't get anywhere near where they're holed up. Light blue whoa, house across the way. Whoa, whoa. They'll gut him immediately if they see us coming. Whoa. But you? They don't know you. You'll be able to stroll right in. After that, whatever you need to do, that's your business. I'm trying Personally, to I'd put a few bullets through their skulls. Let the dirt reclaim them. Can you tell I'm trying to play Minecraft right now, bro? What's in it for me? If he comes back alive, I'll let you snag a few things from our supplies. We've got some meds, decent grub, ammo too. Just don't get greedy. Sounds like I can be of service. Get to it then. Knowing how those savages operate. What was he thinking? People who have chose to be savages. Going to strangers. I suggest you get lost. I will fucking kill. I'm coming back to kill you, anyways. Son of a bitch. Hey, beat it. Why don't you beat it? You got a star in Dylan. Kidding me. Oh shit, I went the wrong way. Quit poking around. What the fuck, Grabby? Trying to make sure that none of these guys fucking die. Because they're obviously gonna get bit, like, randomly for no reason. Also, how would they survive this long if they just get, like, bitten by one single fucking walker? through here I'll be very surprised. Hey. Ding dong ding dong. Come on. Come on. Just a little bit closer man. Oh shit. This stabbing like that literally sucks.
can't grab it. Alright, it's not possible to grab it. I got it. Alright, I can use this as a punching bag. Alright, we're gonna go swing, bro. Wee! Wee! I gotta bring it back, and then I gotta bring it forward, and then I gotta bring it back, and then I gotta bring it forward, and I gotta bring it back. I need that cool hat, bro. Maybe, if I'm feeling particularly cruel, and I'm sure I will be, we'll force you to swallow them whole. How does that grab you? Who the hell are you? The negotiator? A big tough Jeff, too chicken shit to show his face and beg for his little brother's life? Not sure I really see the point. I guess I'm here to negotiate a deal for Anthony's release. Release? That's some kind of joke? That motherfucker isn't going anywhere but in the dirt, where maggots belong. What did he do? This subhuman shit is a murderer. My daughter is dead. The tower is at fault, and he is at fault. The tower preaches community. And yet, they toss out those most in need because they are no longer useful. Because they are a burden. Violet was not a burden. She was a human being. But this fucker treated her like trash. He could have disobeyed orders, but he did not. He forced her out, left her to die. She was 11 years old. Where is your head at, stranger? Exterminate this tower fuck right now, and we won't have a problem. Then, we, the rest of we did what we had to do, right? One less brain-dead tower slug plaguing the world. Fuck it. I think it's time to put some pressure on these fuckers. We're outnumbered, but we have momentum, right? Yeah, the time is right fucking now. You with us? No time like the present. That's the attitude. We've got this. Let's send the message that the future belongs to the Reclaim.
No one in here? Hey, big brother. There's not much to say beyond I'm sorry, but I have to do this. I can't sleep. I can't eat. I'm a wreck. Jeff, I keep seeing that little girl's face. These visions of her turning. This whole mess is fucking with my head. What did the Martins do to deserve being exiled? It makes no sense. They are good people. Now, I know this <coughs> might put you in a tough spot. Please forgive me, but I need to make things right. At least give them a slim chance to survive out there. I swiped some supplies from our camp, so you know who to blame. Don't want any other innocent people taking heat. I'm going out to find the Martins and deliver the stuff. Least I can do. I pray it'll help me get my head straight. If I'm not back before the bells, wish me luck. Your little bro, Anthony. Hey guys, we killed an innocent man. died. Assemble the pump regulator. Assemble the pump regulator. Okay, got it, Bucko. Broken repeater. What are you talking about? This gun is perfectly fine, man. Yeah, I'm just gonna go for right now. Let's see how powerful this bitch is. Yeah. <laughs> 
Same old bitch on the beach. Piercing a skull requires a broad range of motion. It does not require extremely fast movement. Honestly, man, they all died, so I don't really care. So I think I'm just gonna. I'm not sure. I feel like. It's very interesting that one because he that is his fall and I feel like he kind of deserved it so I'm fine with him dying but at the same time I don't want to be with the sinners neither the saints I kind of want to just be on my own Also, they turn into zombies really fast. Welcome to the Great Land of America. Alright. frames. That's <coughs> gone. No, are you fucking kidding me? Alright, you're gonna go the I shouldn't have thrown it away. Can I wear this cool hat? It's not your style though, so you can't wear it. I hate you. Whoever wrote the... <laughs> the descriptions for this game. Like, the item descriptions are hilarious. You there, Casey? Come in. Yeah, yeah, I I'm here. Wow, <laughs> you're back. Did you get it? Had to deal with some shit. But I got what you needed. I delivered. Now it's- <coughs> This is great! <clears throat> Finally, some progress. It's a relief. Okay, uh, let me find the manual for that thing and we can get it calibrated. You're stalling, Casey. I want to hear what you got on the reserve. I'm not doing anything until you hold up your end. We clear? Yeah, yes. All clear. 
Okay, the reserve is real, but you already knew that, right? What you don't know is that I ain't it. It's an old military bunker built in the 50s or 60s. Right after the flood, the National Guard used it as a staging area to distribute disaster relief supplies. But once the dead started walking and things really went to shit, I had no choice but to get inside and hunker down. The reserve is real, but you already knew that, right? The reserve, the reserve, the reserve, the res the, res the, res the, res the reserve <coughs> is real, but you already knew that, right? What you don't know is that I am in it. It's an old military bunker built in the 50s or 60s. The reserve is real, okay, I'm gonna but stop. you already knew that, right? What you don't know is that I am in it. It's an old military bunker built in the 50s or 60s. Right after the flood, the National Guard used it as a staging area to distribute disaster relief supplies. But once the dead started walking and things really went to shit, I had no choice but to get inside and hunker down. I thought I was safe for a little while, but now I'm fucked. The flood water up top was too much for the reserve's pump system. It, it malfunctioned, and now the whole place is on lockdown. I'm stuck in the comm room. I I'm running out of time. I need to get out of here, soon. God, I can't <clears throat> wait to see the sky again. I've been working with someone named May. She claims to have a key to the reserve. You know anything about this? If your May is May Benoit, then yeah, yeah, I've heard of her. Tower is always tossing her name around on the airwaves. They're really after her ass. Consider her a major threat. I don't know anything about a key to the reserve, though. I'll do some research. If I discover anything, I I'll let you know. Rumors are all over the place. What exactly is inside the reserve? Most of the rumors are true. Food, meds, tons of it. I mean, the entire hall was meant to help tens of thousands of people in the area after the flood. And there's a bunch of guns, ammo, and gear for the troops that were meant to distribute it. All military grade, perfect condition. Problem is, I can't get to any of it. The whole bunker is locked down because of the floodwaters. You were the only one to make it inside? Well, no. There were others, but they didn't stay. Um, they had to leave. If the bunker was safe, why did they leave? Like I said, they left. They had to take care of something, okay? Nothing else to say about it. What's the rush to get out of there? Starvation, for one. I might have a couple weeks left of scraps down here. But none of that is going to matter if the flood water sitting on top of this place breaks through. <coughs> the comm room is filling up slowly right now, but it's only a matter of time before the ceiling collapses. Starvation, crushed or drowned. Pick your poison, right? Starvation doesn't seem like an ideal way to go. The slow death. Yeah, well, well with your help, I'm hoping to avoid all of it. Fuck, I'd rather take my chances on the surface with a hundred walkers coming at me. At least I'd have a fighting chance. Look, tourist, I'm not asking you to do this out of the kindness of your heart. I mean, there's clearly something in it for you, uh, uh, big time. If the pumps get repaired, not only will I get out, but the supply rooms will all open up. All those disaster relief supplies, untouched. Not to mention enough weaponry and gear to arm multiple platoons. <coughs> All for you to do with as you please. And for me? A fresh start and some fresh fucking air. Why do you need me to get you out? Plenty of people are looking for the reserve. Why not get one of these groups to help you? Well, my gut tells me that you're my best bet. The Tower and the Reclaimed are both after the reserve, sure. Obsessed with it, you might say. They believe it will shift all the power in NOLA. But I don't trust them. They're too absorbed by their agendas. You're unaligned. On your own. Like me. And hey, we, we may as well help each other. Right? I'm willing to take the risk. Oh, fantastic. You won't regret it. <laughs> it's been a long night, but I'm too wired to sleep. I'm gonna turn this place upside down until I find the manual. 
Uh, you should get some rest, though. I'll contact you in the morning. Good night, tourist. you tomorrow. <laughs> dead have grown a number. Dead have grown a number. Bro, I can't wait. The dead have grown a number. <sighs> dead have grown a number. Hello? It's Casey. Are you there? Yeah. Glad to hear your voice. Ready to get started? Ready as I'll ever be. Okay, good. So, I found the manual for the pump flow regulator. It looks like we need to calibrate it before it can be installed. Each of the pumps has different Ooh. flow requirements, and that component tells the rest <coughs> of the system where to run <coughs> the water. <coughs> Calibration? Flow requirements? This is sounding complicated. The manual's pretty clear. I should be able to talk you through it. Let's start with the serial number. Find it on the device and read it to me. Four seven three zero five eight nine dash zero one. Okay. Uh, now turn the dial until you get some feedback on valve A. Uh, uh, then tell me the number you see. <coughs> Feedback triggered on 55. The numbers turn green. Okay, good. 55. Uh, according to the manual, valve B should be tuned to 28 degrees. I'm just gonna fucking check it. <coughs> <somebody. coughs> valve B to 28. Got it. Perfect. Okay, uh, last valve. One second, one second. There we go. Valve C should be set to 67. Valve C set. All numbers green. Awesome. Okay, uh, almost there. Now it says, depress the automatic confirmation mechanism. Uh, looking at the diagram here, it's a big round button. Should be obvious. All right. Big round button pressed. Yes! Okay, we're calibrated. Now you need to install this sucker into the pump. Uh, the pump, it's, uh, it's located outside of St. Vincent's Church. Beacon lights will be on to help find it, so that's good. Of course, uh, it'll probably attract walkers, so that sucks. Just be ready. The system's down here. <coughs> Let me know when you've installed the regulator. Oh, and uh, one more thing. 
A little tip that should make life a bit easier and scavenging more fruitful since, you know, we're colleagues now, <laughs> right? The tower has a radio station, number 47, that broadcasts any significant discoveries in the city and the current schedule for stirring the herd. Might be wise to tune in before heading out for the day. Privileged intel, so, you know, let's, uh, let's keep it between us. All right, I'm gonna take a few moments to clear my head. I'll contact you when it's time for the next step. Good luck and thanks. Okay. This is probably so boring, but I gotta stream it. <coughs> Make sure, blah, 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 blah. What's perhaps? I just really want to get this. Okay. Work with the case to calibrate the. It's at the church, okay. I'm not ready yet. I know I'm not. ready. Fucking Wolverine over here. Okay. Um. Uh, might as well bring bow and arrow. No, bow and arrows kind of suck. Well, right now against a horde, but they're they're in some situations. Some wood scraps. All right, I'm gonna go get wood scraps before I <clears throat> church. I'm just gonna go to the shallows and get some wood, like real quick, and then I'm I'm running out of there. To pace makes waste instead of sprinting to objectives. Try saving stamina for when you need to run away. Meds are valuable, I know, but if I had a couple of pills, I could make some trades. Help my family. What do you think? Can you help me out with some meds? Okay, I need to find her some meds. Please, that's not what I need to help. Something 
sucks. You're my friend, said Jordan Romero. Only one person's watching. Sprinting, climbing, melee combat, use stamina. Over time, they make you hungry, reducing max stamina. I don't even think I have lungs. I'm not. Let's just stab them all. Really, I really need wood scraps. That's all I'm going in here for. She's gone. I think she died. Okay. scraps. <laughs> well, I don't have any fucking medicine. How big is this map again? There's not even a fucking map for this area. I just need that. I don't want to be waiting around for get fucking eaten. Now is not the time no, to be fucking thing. Now is the no, time to the commit time. to a community. To be part of something. <laughs> Our vision for the future is rooted in hope. It ensures a future for humanity. Cast despair aside. There is no point in clinging to it. Do not commit to isolation. Dedicate yourself to a grander purpose, and you will not be alone. Trust in us to guide you, and we will put our trust in you. Within our walls, you will be safe. Within our walls, your needs will be met. Within our walls, Life goes on. The tower will always the stand. The only thing standing between you and Mama. death is your food.
<clears throat> That's why I don't want you fucking food. Simple as that. I'm gonna go back home, I guess. Well, this is that it was you and that's his food. Yeah, well... Uh, funny pun. Check station 47 for intel. Check station 47. Oh, station 47. Oh, shit. Alright, I'm gonna look at that. Supply is getting more scarce. Listen to frequency 47. Impressory medical food and weapons. Cages for extra loot events. That's kind of weird. They should have like an online area where you can like shoot people and fight them. That'd be really cool. I'm not sure you're even supposed to fucking speed run this game. What was I gonna do? Oh yeah, I was gonna get some milk scraps. 47, okay. Reclaimed heavies, overwhelming, old town. <coughs> Clean weapons over heavy, old town. Okay. Someone wants to fucking look out for us. Not exactly, you know what I mean. I'm trying to upgrade this one. Shit. Okay, guys, I'm gonna take a break. Uh, I'm gonna be back on in like 12 minutes. I just need to charge my thing. My mc- my mc- my mc- chicken. Alright. Oh no, when it dies, I'll charge my mc- chicken. You know what? For 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 the hell, <coughs> let's uh exit the menu. Yes, let's play the survival mode for it. Like the mode where basically you just have to go through hordes and hordes and hordes of zombies. Is there anything else? Walking dead. Saints and saners. Alright. 
to a gunfight unless you're really good at throwing it. <laughs> they should have like an extra mode where like you can actually make it like a throwing knife. Like you know how you hold a throwing knife. I think I'm good for right now. Let's go. This is the action part. Woo! told you this game is no fucking joke Jesus How did you turn on 125 I'll survive with the shiv How much is another shiv Nah that's stupid I want to buy a cleaver next What's up my dicky dog Okay See how fucking powerful this shit is. This will be just in case. I was gonna decapitate them. Well, let me take this person's head. There we go. Where'd the head go? Thank you. Come on, man. You for the head, man. <laughs> I 
Need to go eat. Let's not buy anything. It's not a point to. I have my trusty dusty fucking cleaver. I'm gonna say hello. Hello there, friend. Donate your arm, sir. Oh. Sir, I need your arm. Give me your arm. Thank you. <laughs> Game mode is extremely fucking difficult. <sighs> oh my god. <laughs> okay. Got a D minus minus. Best. Graveyard. Memorial. I'm gonna go graveyard. Alright. When pinch, use arrows. Can be used for stabbing. Shot arrows can be recovered and reused. Okay. Warm up time, craft a weapon.
Nine millimeter rounds, okay. This one in story would be really overpowered. The judge. this at someone. Let me start decapitating. See, you're my friend. You're my best friend. You see what I did to your friend? If you don't, I walk away right now. I'll do the same to you. <laughs> I told you. You see what I did to your friend? <laughs> I need your head. Give me your fucking head. Okay. I can go up. Stand back. You see what I did to your friend? I'll do the same to you. No. You know what? I don't want your head. I just want to kill you. You too. I'll get you. Okay then. Just. Aw oh man. Can you get your head? I need to... <laughs> Ow. I've been in a VR headset all day. Jesus Christ. Okay. I think I might need a new weapon soon. That's what these guys are for. I could just do that. Where the fuck did my cleaver go? Shit. I have a fucking can. I'm gonna kill y'all. I say it, I have a can. I have a can! Alright. Fuck, this is not good. Come on, man.
Come on, man. No, that makes no sense. D minus minus, D minus minus. Okay, let me try a different one then. Memorial Lane. Vicarola. Vicarola. Let me see. No. Sure. That's a lot. <laughs> Don't come near me. Don't come near me. See guys, that's how you use the force. The force is within you. Use the force to eat ass, smoke grass, and skate fast. Alright, bombs.
See what I did, your friend? You will see what I did, your friend. I'm gonna do that to you. Here's your new head. Oh, man. Look me. I fucking love the cleaver, dude. <laughs> Man. All right. Thank you for the heads. I love you. I got your friend's head. You see? You see? I'm gonna do that to you. All right. Thank you. See what I did, your friend? All right. See what I did, your friend? Oh, fuck! No! Stop! <laughs> anymore. Are you fucking kidding me? Hey. I'm just gonna sit here, man. Oh, fuck, it's one of you. I did to your friend? Oh, you don't care. Thank you. Put you in here. Man, I got a friend. Alright. Don't have anything. Great. I really can't even crack a fucking shiv. See what I did to your friend? Man. Alright, I'm gonna use the force on you guys. You guys don't stop, I'm gonna use the force on you. See, I told you to stop. Guys, you should have stopped. No, my friend! God damn it. Cleaver. Another cleaver. For the road. And got an extra pipe bomb just in case. Okay. Oh.
My friend now. Yep. Best friend. Oh shit. I'm infected. Fuck. Later.